This will be a short introduction video to Kimsis. Because this is such a short video, I would like to offer a bonus piece of trivia as well. Where does the phrase, I need to see a man about a dog come from? The phrase, I need to see a man about a dog, is usually a polite way of excusing yourself from a conversation in order to do something that you wouldn't normally bring up in polite company, such as going to the toilet. It is derived from a play in 1866 called Flying Scud, where a man ignores a difficult question by stating, Excuse me, Mr. Quail, I can't stop. I've got to see a man about a dog, that is, a dog in dog racing. So, back to Kimsis. Kimsis is an acronym that stands for Cortex Microcontroller Software Interface Standard and is produced and distributed by ARM for use with their processors. The goals of Kimsis are to provide what is called an abstraction layer on top of the lower levels of hardware and software, to provide various debugging tools, and to make sure people have to deal with thumb to assembly as little as possible. This does not mean knowing assembly is completely useless, as anything having to do with precise timing or speed will perform much better with the use of assembly. Instead, this is for developers to make developing on ARM hardware much easier. Kimsis is free to download and use. From my interpretation of the legal documentation, it appears as though you can write a program using Kimsis as a base and then sell your program without having to pay any additional fees to ARM, although you really should read through and understand the legal documents yourself before you start using Kimsis. Kimsis consists of a variety of components including the Kimsis Core. This provides basic API functions in C for general use. Everything from clocks to interrupts is in here. The Kimsys driver. This is used by middleware to connect other devices with the Cortex processor. For example, a Bluetooth antenna attachment will still need to communicate with the processor, and so Kimsys driver allows people who make the Bluetooth antenna hardware to have a nice general interface to the processor, independent of who actually makes the hardware that surrounds that processor be it ST or Freescale. Kimsys DSP. This is a digital signal processing library that contains over 60 functions. Kimsys RTOS API. Much like the driver, this provides a nice general template for real-time operating system creators to build upon, so they don't have to worry about what kind of hardware the system is being installed into. Kimsys SVD. The SVD stands for System View Description for Peripherals. This can be used to gather information from other peripherals and feed that information into a software debugger. Kimsys DAP. The debug access port is more standardized firmware that is intended for use on evaluation boards. You won't see this software used on final products. 